Hey everyone, welcome to my very first video. I'm super excited to dive into the world of travel with you today. We're going to explore some of the top tourist destinations around the globe, and I'll be sharing the best seasons to visit each one. Whether you're a seasoned traveler or just dreaming about your next getaway, I hope this information inspires you to pack your bags and hit the road. So, let's get started. First up, let's talk about Paris, France. Ah, the city of light. Paris is breathtaking any time of year, but if you want to experience it at its most magical, I'd recommend visiting in the spring, specifically April to June. The weather is mild, the flowers are blooming, and you can stroll along the Seine with a warm croissant in hand. Don't forget to visit iconic spots like the Eiffel Tower, the Louvre, and Montmartre. Plus, there's nothing quite like enjoying a picnic in the Luxembourg Gardens while soaking in the beauty of the city. Next on our list is Kyoto, Japan. This city is renowned for its stunning temples and traditional tea houses, and the best time to visit is during the cherry blossom season, which usually peaks in late March to early April. Imagine walking through the streets lined with sakura trees in full bloom, the petals gently falling like pink snowflakes around you. It's a sight that feels almost otherworldly. Make sure to stop by Kiyomizu Dera and take a moment to appreciate the view from its wooden terrace. It's a moment that will stay with you forever. Now, let's hop over to Sydney, Australia. If you're looking for sun, surf, and adventure, the best time to visit is during their summer months from December to February. You can hit the famous Bondi Beach, explore the Sydney Opera House, and take a ferry ride across the harbor for breathtaking views. The vibe is vibrant, with festivals and events happening all around the city. Just don't forget your sunscreen. The Australian sun can be pretty intense. Moving on, we can't forget about New York City. The Big Apple is a year-round destination, but if you want to experience the magic of the holiday season, December is the time to go. Picture this, the Rockefeller Center Christmas tree, ice skating in Central Park, and the dazzling window displays along Fifth Avenue. The energy in the city during the holidays is electric, and it's a time when you can truly feel the spirit of New York. Just be prepared for the crowds, because everyone wants to experience this winter wonderland. Let's take a moment to travel to the breathtaking landscapes of Iceland. The best time to visit is during the summer months, from June to August, when the days are long and the weather is relatively mild. You can explore the stunning waterfalls, geysers, and the famous Blue Lagoon. Plus, you'll have the chance to experience the midnight sun, where the sun barely sets, giving you more time to explore the incredible natural beauty of this unique country. And, if you're lucky, you might even catch a glimpse of the northern lights if you time your visit right. Now, let's head to Rome, Italy. This historical city is a treasure trove of culture, and the best time to visit is during the fall, specifically September to October. The weather is pleasantly warm, and the summer crowds have thinned out. You can wander through the ancient ruins of the Colosseum, toss a coin into the Trevi Fountain, and indulge in delicious gelato while soaking up the rich history that surrounds you. Trust me, there's nothing quite like enjoying a leisurely meal in a quaint trattoria while the sun sets over the cobblestone streets. Next, let's explore Cape Town, South Africa. The best time to visit is from November to March, when the weather is warm and sunny. You can hike up Table Mountain for stunning panoramic views, visit the beautiful beaches of Camps Bay, and take a trip to the Cape of Good Hope. The vibrant culture and stunning landscapes make this destination a must-visit. Plus, don't miss out on the local wine tours in Stellenbosch. They're an experience that tantalizes your taste buds. Now, let's make our way to the beautiful beaches of Bali, Indonesia. The best time to visit is during the dry season, from April to October. This is when you can enjoy the sun, surf, and stunning sunsets without the interruptions of rain. Bali is not just about the beaches. You can explore lush rice terraces, visit ancient temples, and immerse yourself in the local culture. Whether you're looking for relaxation or adventure, Bali has it all. And let's not forget about the delicious food. The local cuisine is a feast for the senses. Lastly, let's not overlook the stunning landscapes of the Canadian Rockies. 
The best time to visit is during the summer months, from June to September, when the weather is warm and the parks are accessible. You can hike through Banff National Park, take a scenic drive along the Icefields Parkway, and marvel at the turquoise waters of Lake Louise. The natural beauty is simply breathtaking, and it's a perfect destination for outdoor enthusiasts. Just be sure to keep your camera ready. Every corner you turn offers a new picture-perfect view. So, there you have it. A whirlwind tour of some of the top tourist destinations around the world and the best seasons to visit each one. I hope this inspires you to start planning your next adventure. Remember, travel is about creating memories, experiencing new cultures, and stepping out of your comfort zone. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more travel tips and destinations. Let's embark on this journey together, and I can't wait to share more with you in the next video. Safe travels, everyone!